After the night quest of the last one, okay, we have... Oh, wow, I don't know what to go with here. Flaming arrows. Or do we go with concrete mix? Hmm. I mean, 250 concrete mix early on can be a kind of big deal. I want to say we'll go ahead and take that. What do we I have here? Wagner jobs. Residence well, or you like you Johnny Town? You know what? Don't I remember driving by Johnny Town and well. I remember thinking that looks Check interesting. And I don't know if we've been there before. So you're restocking on day 19. Cheaper, I forgot to make note. We're day 17. Better. I got machines that'll make your heart skip a beat. Uh, you do have armored up. I know we're close to that. We were at the end of the last one. We were pretty close on that one. Just looking at what else you have. It's got a night vision mod. It's got an AK. I mean, he actually has some pretty decent stuff. Some bow parts. I mean, I don't know. I, I'm. So I don't want to buy anything just yet. But I think maybe what we'll do is we'll keep our options open because there might be something that's worth buying here today. I'm not really sure just yet. For now, let's go ahead and go run over to Johnny Town and see what we got going on. I couldn't have even told you anything about this place by the name. But as soon as I drive up, I'm like, yep, we're going to end right in there. That's how we're coming out of this place. So if you don't know this one already, let me spoil everything for you by saying we're going to start right up here. Well, are you are you now feeling everything is spoiled? And then watch out because uh, things are going to... Ooh, bow hunter book. Look at that. Compound bow quality six. Nice. I don't think this place used to be like this. This must be one of the variations where... It's kind of a, I don't know what you would call this, a furnished attic or something. I want to take a look at that right quick since we can now do that. Gosh, oh, hi. Caps lock. I'm going to blame my cat. She was stomping around earlier, even if she wasn't. I'm going to say she was. So we need 18 bow parts, and we've got like two because um, as it happens, I, I might have forgotten where they all are, and they're probably at some other base. So, you know. Minor details aside, I think we have most everything else that we would need to be able to whip out a nice, super high-quality bow. We certainly have the Lego parts, so I'm not not at all concerned about having enough of those guys. I don't know. I mean, i got to be honest. I'm tempted to go back now, like right now. Well, maybe not right now since we actually started this quest. But I'm, I'm kind of tempted to go back and uh, figure out where all those parts are hiding because, dang it, I would love to have... A nice high quality bow that would be fantastic going from a quality five wooden bow to a quality six compound bow it's not necessarily a huge huge difference but the velocity upgrade is pretty significant hey look at that light armor five and medium and heavy that's that's pretty good i'm I'm not unhappy with that at all. Oh, by the way, this is a fetch quest, isn't it? I remember. I remember now. Okay. Well, it's going to be a minute before we find where the, the package is located, because it's downstairs. And we're not ready to go downstairs just yet. Um, I don't think we are anyway. Pretty sure we've got a little more room to go through before we do that. Adam. You know, I'd really like us to get a weapon upgrade, aside from aside from the bow. I'm thinking more melee. Ooh, look at that. Sham chowder. We are going to need to... Well, no, I guess we're fine right now. I was going to say we're going to need to eat soon, but never mind. We need to drink water soon, not eat. I got my things backwards. There we go. There's downstairs. How you doing? Oh, man. Totally whiffed on that. Would have been fun. Oh, well. But I would like us to get... A weapon upgrade. I mean, quality five hunting knife, sure. That would be okay. But I don't know. I mean, I, w I think I'm ready to go to Machete. Since we've kind of taken a path down the agility skill tree, then, you know, it makes sense to stick with what brought us to the dance, and that would be blades. But I don't know. I mean, I would be fine with trying something else. And I don't know, like, it's it's been a... It's been a minute since I've gone full sledgehammer build, I think. I feel like maybe I've kind of recently done one, but it might have been I was just using the stone sledgehammer in the early game. 
because uh, those are actually pretty decent. They're really not bad at all. You can make them work, like you really can. But for right now, at least, I would like to stick with Machete if we are so able to put it to use. How you doing? Or put one to use, rather. I figure we'd just go ahead and put the pusher bot over there just in case there's someone coming around the corner. I mean, they sort of came from around the corner, but it was this corner. Minor details and such, right? A couple of dies in here. I didn't mean to grab any lead. Get the lead out. I don't want it. I'm sure I'll be regretting that later on, and that's fine. Let's go ahead and hop in the pipe. So this way is going to be the way to keep going. But just for the giggles here. Yep, this guy's going to have something behind it. There are a lot more of those types of things in the game than I have been spending time to find. Like, specifically, I have not even bothered to look behind paintings and that sort of stuff. Paintings, posters, whatever. Like, I just kind of don't care. But every once in a while, it's kind of fun to just, you know, take a look, see what's going on. I think these guys will all bleed out if we give them the opportunity. Not 100% sure of that. I mean, if someone comes and smacks me in the back of the head, I guess we know otherwise, right? But yeah, all three of those guys are toast, so. One stabby stabby, two stabby stabby, three wabby stabby. That's all useful stuff there. I mean, as long as we're getting him in the head, that's going to do the most damage, obviously. But that'll probably get them low enough where they're going to bleed out. At least these kind of regular zombies. Bigger, beefier ones, not as much. Take that, scrap that, scrap that, scrap that. You can have... Nope. You can have that back. Right over your shoulder. I tried. A 4x scope schematic that guy was carrying around. Okay. I'm not upset with that at all. That's that's a good little find right there. I'm sure at some point we will want a 4x scope on something. I wouldn't mind putting one on a pistol. Put it on a revolver even. Why not? Looks goofy as can be, but <laughs> it works. Technically. You know, I wonder, since we have ourselves a crucible by way of the very last episode, I wonder if we should be doing that. We should be collecting all the tires we can. Kick all the tires. Because now that we have the crucible, that means we can be pumping out steel arrowheads. And man, as soon as we go to steel arrowheads, that's one just really significant upgrade. And then we're going to go to two compound bow. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to have two really significant upgrades happening at basically the same time. Or close enough, anyway. Knocked that guy's head off. Excellent. Knife was like, I heard all that talk about the machete earlier. You don't need no machete. You got me. That's right, buddy. We got you. Let's go get rid of a chair, and then I think we should probably stop and heal up a little bit. What's the food going to be on that guy? 53. Where are we at? On food. We're not quite there yet. So we're going to need to wait until we're in the 60% before we bother with that food. I was just looking at things we can get rid of. Inventory space that we can clear out. That's all. I mean, we're not overburdened yet, but we are knocking on the door. Knock, knock, knocking on overburdened's door. Pretty sure that's how the Bob Dylan song goes. Doesn't look like we can loot any of these things. That's that's a right shame is what that is. That is a poorly designed bathroom where... Yeah. That door should be flipped. Should The hinges should be on the other side. I mean, you shouldn't be able to block the whole doorway with... Yeah, see like these guys? Yeah, much better. Although still. Bigger bathroom so that you don't have to use such big doors, you know, and block everything off again. Poorly designed bathroom. Whoever is the architect here? I don't know. I mean, good on them, I guess, but very interesting design they put out. And I know you can't actually do all the things I'm asking in the game. 
Doesn't work that way. I know, I know. Just being facetious, what can I say? Let's go up over here where we'll have ourselves a nice little kitchen area. It's going to connect across the way where we're going to have a nice zombie area. Try not to spoil the crap out of everything. Just, you know, a fun few things here and there. Like, you can see this guy right now, right? Hmm. Hmm. Third time's a charm. There we go. Third time is a charm. Excellent. So that's going to be where our final loot is. You could see the crate over there earlier. If you didn't catch it, we'll see it in just a second. Let's go ahead and bounce. Doing. And we're going to bounce. And we're going to be SMRT about this. We're going to put this guy right there. Okay. Anytime you want to push him. Anytime you want to push him. There you go. That's the correct direction. Pusher bot's like, dude, I'm doing what I can. You got to help me out here. Thank you, pusher bot. I have no idea where the rest of these guys went. There were several of them, I think. Maybe they're all down on the bottom, bottom floor. All right, let's go fall on the couch. How you doing? Blood just spilling out everywhere. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Oh, boy. I totally forgot this was a fetch quest. We might have to do some backtracking. Let's see if it's up on this level. It is on this level, so I think we'll be okay. Because it's over here somewhere. There it is. I actually just saw the bag before I saw the icon for it. I was like, okay, yeah. We're in an okay spot. That's fine. That worked out all right. Now let's go ahead and switch out you for shovel. Because I do want to grab a couple of these bags. So we got one right here and then one right there. We'll start with the shotgun messiah box. Uh, type shotgun quality six. Okay. I mean, I would never make one, but whatever. We'll take all the things. Extra tire is not a bad thing at all. Impact Bracing Mod Schematic. Okay, we'll go ahead and take that. No problem there. Treasure Hunters Mod. Oh, I totally forgot. Don't we have like some candy back at home that I keep forgetting to take? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, so 10 XP plus 5 loot stage and treasure radius minus 1. That's the old um, Nerd Goggles, maybe? No, it's like Nerd Goggles and something else combined. I'm not sure. Hmm. Commando Boots, quality 5, though. That's not too shabby. Anyway, uh, we'll gladly take all those things and check this destroyed workbench. I was hoping for something a little different than that, but that's okay. Wow. 12 arrowheads. Not bad. I mean, those are the high-quality ones, just to be clear. And look at that. A box full of uh, scrap metal. <laughs> Forge ahead. Got some glue. We can go ahead and open up both sets of doors. That's perfectly fine. Let's go turn this crap in. That was a good time. I'm kind of thinking right now I might want to just hot shot this. Um, sure. I mean, probably should have taken the steel, but it's fine. But I think I might want to hot shot this and try and move us on to the next area as quickly as possible. Because if we do it quickly enough, we can bypass a horde knight, quote unquote, so to speak. We're not actually bypassing anything, but... We still have a few days before the next horde, and I would prefer not to set up a horde base out here when I know we're going to be very, very close to moving on. So that's, I don't know. I mean, the more I think about that, the more I like the idea, the more it sounds good to me that we can just, oh, this is where we were initially looking at setting up base. How funny. But I do like the idea of that, I think. that. Probably wouldn't be a, a bad idea overall. Here, let's go ahead and open up the box. So we got some of that, we got some of that, and we got some of that. Okay. So stone sledge and iron sledge quality one. Look at that. That's not bad. Stone sledge was going to be, you know, quality six, mind you. Then we got the compound crossbow that no one cares about. It's a trash weapon. I know. It's controversial. Don't care. Actually, don't hate it. It's perfectly a fine weapon. I just don't 
I don't use it. I think that's maybe a, a fair way of saying it. I know it's a good weapon. I prefer not to use it. It's not really my jam. And uh, that's totally okay. It doesn't have to be, right? Here, we'll just drop some of that stuff off in there. Let's go and take a look at what we got going on in here. We got a Fortitude mod. I guess what we'll do is we'll take this guy out and we're going to pop this one in because I want the five extra loot stage. That is more important to me than one point in Fortitude because we can then very easily just go back here and go, done, spent a point of Fortitude. I don't know. I mean, whatever. Like, I kind of wonder if we should maybe use some of these guys just to kind of reduce how, how much food we go through. And getting up to cardio probably wouldn't be a bad one, too. Just, I don't know. The more we can get, uh, the more stamina we can get while sprinting, kind of the better to me. We need agility level 10 to get up to that guy, which I don't know if it's worth it for the last 10%. That's kind of, it's kind of asking a lot. Same with this guy. I don't know, but the extra stamina here is kind of the important part on, on that one. Oh, I didn't realize we were missing that. Well, shoot, that's worth it. I mean, here, we'll go ahead and put that point there just to get us kind of set. Uh, I realize we're not even using medium armor, we're using light armor. So that'll be something to look into at some point. I might need to just spec out of that, I don't know. I don't even know where light armor is. Maybe there isn't a light armor? I think maybe there is not a light armor skill, which is weird to me. Like, that's very strange to me. There is no light armor skill. There's a medium armor skill, which shouldn't even be under agility. That should be under perception. And then agility should be light armor. And then strength should be heavy armor. Or... I mean, I guess maybe you could say medium would be under fortitude with light under agility instead of perception. That's probably better. Uh, but then there's probably an imbalance in the number of skills applied to each of these things. Whatever. Let's just go inside. This is dumb. This is a fetch quest, so we could really get in, get out. Doesn't matter. I mean, it'll be fine. It'll be what it'll be, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, madam, I need you to die. Thanks, because you're kind of blocking the way. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. You know, that that light attack, pretty dang fast, I gotta say. I don't know, I, did we pick up like only 7% speed on it or something? It's, I mean, it's still pretty quick, right? Like, it's pretty quick. It's pretty quick. So not that way. Where are we looking for in here? We're going to be... Oh, interesting. There's a switch that we have to pull. It's specifically highlighting a switch for us. That's kind of fun. Anyway, we're looking for the White River package, so keep an eye peeled for that. Madam? That guy's toast. And I'm ignoring her, because she should be dead by now. And besides, we don't even have to kill all of them. It doesn't matter. Ah. Stupid birds. Hey, look at that. We just spent a point. We got a point back. Spend a point, get a point. I'm okay with that. How you doing? Uh, can we even get through there? I mean, we can go around, obviously, but... It's one of those things where I'm like, can we even get through there? I don't even know. Where do we go from here, then, huh? Right down in there, it looks like. Um, I don't even know how to get in there. Like, I literally... I, I think I have to do this to get in here, because... Oh, holy crap, dude. My jump skill is too high. Okay, I gotta, I gotta knock the top off of it. Sir, I'm busy. You don't mind. I don't think we have what we need to take care of that. I mean, we have it back. Oh my gosh. We have it back at the base, but we don't have it here. Oh, maybe you're not supposed to go in here. Okay. I mean, it sure looked like it was perfectly set up to jump into. My bad. Well, let's take the obvious way then. 
We'll have to go back and grab some vitamins because that's what it's going to take right now. I'm not worried about the abrasion as much. Probably should be choosing not to worry about it, but uh, I don't know. Do we have a bunch of these guys right now? Uh, all right, well, we'll use the one. It's fine. 43 minutes down to 17. I don't know that we have any real bonuses on reducing the critical heal time, but whatever, that's cool. Could switch some... Uh, Oh, hello. Some armor around, and I'm pretty sure we could find some on one of the armor sets. Vehicles up to 27. Not bad. 64 on the cooking. Getting pretty close to the end on cooking. I mean, we're more than halfway there. I feel like that's, you know, not too shabby. All things... All things equal there. Let's go in the office first. Oh, there is a safe back there. Let's go crack this bad boy open. Man. This whole fatigue thing right now is awful. Iron Nux quality too. Not bad considering we haven't specced into that at all. That's quite a few books, magazines, whatever found. It's not bad at all. But yeah, stamina is uh, stamina's just awful right now. Downstairs we go. I was just double checking to make sure that downstairs is indeed correct. It is, we're good. So somewhere in that direction there, to the east, it's going to be where we're headed. How you doing? Guy was a kind of ninja zombie with the part, the exception there that wasn't very agile. Just kind of fell all over the place when he landed. My bad. My bad. Don't mind me. I'm just going to come crashing into you. Works for me. Could have been dangerous otherwise, right? Damn. Be dead, please. Be dead. You can be dead. And we will be fine. ATMs, I mean, those are not too shabby, but it's what, 5 or 10k to break into one? Yeah. You get a bunch of money out of them, like literal old green uh, green backs, as it were. But I don't know. I don't care. If we were in a spot where we could get through it quicker, maybe. But we're not, so no sense messing with it. It's fine. Trying to get as many power attacks in as possible. I mean, he's already bleeding, so we don't need to worry too much about getting bleed stacks in, but just the same. Ooh, that's worth a good little chunk of plastic there. We really do need to just kind of blow through all these iron arrows. I had that thought, and then I haven't really been using the bow, so you know, let's try and let's try and use the bow a little more. Oh man, I wanted to check the clothing racks. I happen to know from poking around, looking at some things. And it wasn't... Well, I guess it actually technically was for this reason. Clothing racks, stuff like this, these shelves, shoe shelves, clothing piles, that sort of stuff. Those are what you want to look for if you are looking for legendary parts. I kind of needed to do a little research for my mod, so... That's why I was even looking in the first place. It wasn't just because I was trying to find out. There was an actual rhyme and reason behind why I wanted to find out. Yeah, that's the answer, though, is look for clothing piles and things, and then chances are you're going to find what you're looking for. We need to repair some stuff here before too long. I mean, the fire axe came to us pretty damaged, but the knife, that's been all us. It's been all us. Where are we at, by the way, on, on knifey action if we wanted to make a blade? Three away. We're very close. Okay, we'll go ahead and walk through the door and trigger everything. Okay. And it's literally just what I was saying about trying to use some arrows up. Alright, this guy we're just going to have to deal with now. Oh, I think he lost his face. Perfect. Perfect. 
Sure. Body shot. Take it. How you doing, sir? Dang, he just straight up tanked an arrow to the chin. Man, these bikers, I tell you, they can be they can be a real pain in the butt. Yeah, spear parts, sure. Take a spear, why not? I mean, we're not really gonna make a, a decent spear anytime soon. Chances are all these parts that we've been collecting, we're just gonna sell them off, right? We don't really need them. They don't do anything for us, so probably just sell them off. There's our courier satchel. Bomb bonk. I mean, we've already killed everyone, so there's really no one in there to cause us some problems. You're supposed to fall down there if you were up top. Surprise! You're in a bathroom full of zombies. Better get out. That wasn't too shabby. Let's go and get these prepped. I had a coffee from something. Ooh, look at that. There's an upgrade. So I just went ahead and used it. I figured, <laughs> you know, whatever. It's fine. Um, quality five. Yeah, we'll go ahead and throw those guys in there. And then oh, I didn't even look. Nope, not bad. There we go. Uh, where are we at on damage with this thing? Because I assume it's going to be better. Yeah. 6.1 better. That's not too shabby. That's a nice little upgrade right there at the end of the episode. I'm, I'm good with that. Take all that stuff. Check this guy. Got a rogue hood upgrade. So I think what we have right now is a quality two. Yeah, look at that. Take that out. And then it's not going to be much of an upgrade, but it will be a very slight one. Or at least that gives us another slot, and I'm pretty sure we have a water filter we can go ahead and pop in place. We need to repair that armor, but that's fine. We can worry about that in a minute. I mean, what, do we, what does it take to repair these guys these days? Oh, still a repair kit, okay. I mean, I kind of figured that was the case. Yeah, we'll have, to, we'll have to work on that. That's fine. I mean, I didn't even really check to make sure, but it should be... Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, 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 wow. It should be uh, better than what we're currently using. Got a stack of tires over here. We are good. I think with this, we can hit the button and get out of here. Man, we got some crap we need to think about. I don't even know where to begin right now. I am just... Wow, I am blown away with all the stuff we found at the end here. Like, not even joking, just... Ooh, some really, really good quality stuff. Hey, we needed the vitamins, so that's, that's actually kind of convenient. We are no longer weak. Our armor is weak, but we can fix that. And we will do that on the next one. Catch that one, Dylan. Thanks for watching. Adam. See you later.